We are in a race against time for smarter development. Are we using science to build the future we want? We are spending more on research as a share of GDP. This means that global research spending has grown faster than the global economy since 2014. But almost half of this growth, 44%, has occurred in China alone. Despite some progress, 80% of countries are still spending less than 1% of their GDP on research. In developing countries, companies spend less on research. They tend to import package technologies from abroad rather than develop their own. Governments are trying to make it easier for companies to innovate, such as by providing them with tax incentives or a nurturing environment in the form of tech incubators and technology parks. In Iran, Government support for tech incubators has led to exponential growth in knowledge-based firms and startups since 2015. Tech incubators are now widespread in Africa. 13 African countries have more than 20 tech hubs. Worldwide, the researcher pool has grown almost three times faster than the global population since 2014. By 2018, there were 8.9 million researchers in the world. That is a million more researchers than four years earlier. Some governments are taking steps to improve the remuneration of scientists. In some countries, the number of researchers per million inhabitants has grown by at least 20% in just four years. Researcher density has grown most rapidly in low-income countries. Worldwide, scientific publications have surged by 21%. But the G20 countries still account for nine-tenths of researchers, research spending and scientific publications.